In this video, we're gonna be harvesting our softwood cuttings experiment where we um, used both Rose of Sharon and Prunus sericifera um, to see if there was a difference in the effect of using no hormone and organic hormone uh, from a product called Earth Juice and a synthetic hormone by Bontone 2 and the synthetic hormone in that is IBA. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start dumping these out um, and seeing which ones of them developed roots. Let's just go ahead with the control first and the Rosa Sharon. And I'm just gonna kind of toss this in here. It looks like we've got a little bit of root growth happening there, but not much. This is another one of those time sensitive experiments where we probably just didn't have enough time for these to completely go. So the leaves are still green on these, but we have no roots and not very much callus on this. Okay, also in the control, no roots, no callus. Here. One with roots. That's it. And then lastly, Here is another one that has, no, nope. I wouldn't call that well rooted at all. Okay, so it looks like we got two out of 20 for our control on the Rose of Sharon. Now let's do the plums. Visual inspection so that shows that we still have greening on the top, but no, not a lot of callus on the bottom. I've got nothing here, and nothing there, and nothing here. So even though the tips of these still stayed quite green, we have um, no plums in our control group that have developed roots, and only two rows of Sharon that have developed roots. Next, we're gonna do our organic treatment. Um, visual inspection on these says that they look a little bit more yellow on the top. Um, not quite as vibrant as the control group, but let's see what it looks like inside the pot. Okay, I got nothing here. And nothing there. Okay. Zero for five. Okay, here we've got some callus forming, but not really roots. Okay. And nothing. Time is probably still a really big factor in this. We just need more time than 10 weeks to be able to propagate a lot of soft wood cuttings. All right, so from our first round of looking at things here with our earth juice, we have zero. Zero plants rooting with the organic hormone in the rows of Sharon. Now let's take a look at the plums. Ooh, here's a good one. Look at that. So we've got quite a bit of little root and callus happening there, so that's one. This varies drastically by plant type too. So um, I had selected a couple that naturally form lots of root suckers, hoping that they would go a little bit faster for you guys. But it looks like that's not the case. Ooh, two, hey, look at that. All right. Okay, so, so far we're up to two with the plums. Okay, and it looks like that number is going to stand. So two out of 20 
uh, for the plums with earth juice and zero for 20 for uh, Rosa Sharon with the earth juice is our final count. Lastly, we're going to take a look at our synthetic hormone, which is IBA from a product called Bontone 2. And again, we'll start with the Rosa Sharon cuttings here. Visual inspection shows a little bit of yellowing, not really doing a whole lot, but not total die off either. I don't think I'm going to count that as one. Okay, there we go. We are zero for five. This one's got quite a bit of callus and it's pushing out, so I'm gonna count that. Oh, here's another one that has a little tiny root. This one has a little tiny root. These are in toast. Okay, so so far we have three. Three from our Rosa Sharon in the bottom. Here. There's one. And here's two. Nice. That one's no one. The last pot of Rosa Sharon. Oh, here's one. Nope, that's not one. I better just knock it off. I am seeing some pretty good callus forming on these, so I think that like this one will count. Um, I, I think that if they just had another couple of weeks, they would just totally rock it. Okay, so for our Rosa Sharon in the Bontone 2, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We have 7 out of 20 um, with the Bontone 2 Rosa Sharon. Now let's take a look at our plums. Oh, here's one, two two in our first pot. Oh, and this one has a lot that's starting to push out. I'm going to count that as three. See, this one is, it's got all this, all this stuff that's just starting to, little tiny primordia that are starting to push. They just need a little bit more time. But we're trying to catch this snapshot. Oh, there's a lot of roots in here from something. Look at that. These are probably the biggest roots that we've seen so far from this experiment, huh? Cool. This one is pushing some out. That one is not. Oh, and this one has some too. Okay. Oh, nice. We got a couple of really good ones here too. Okay, and here's some more. Wow. I'd say that looks like a significant difference to me, and I didn't even crunch any of the numbers for sure. There we go. There's that one has roots. And this one has roots. And no, that's very late on that one. That one has a lot of callus and some root. Okay, cool. So for plums in the Bontone 2, let's just count how many we got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 out of 20. That's pretty good, huh? 15 out of 20 for the Bontone 2 with the plums. Um, and then we had 2 and 0 for the earth juice. And in our control, we had 0 and 2. All right, pretty cool, huh?